The moment stressed and gloom King Charles lit up when he saw adult Prince Louis. Prince Louis stepped in to lift the mood in the days leading up to the coronation when King Charles and Queen Camilla rehearsed the ceremony in stressful and long sessions. From bishops to the king, day after day of coronation rehearsals were taking the toll on the royal rascal Prince Louis stepped in to lift the mood. A well-placed source said that after hours spent you know, sitting on head pews, Bishop Fawford, the aligned and text from Queen Elizabeth's coronation in 1953 was used instead of an updated version. Even the normally jovial King Charles was looking worn down and gloom sitting on his throne in Westminster Abbey, but then he spotted his grandson, Prince Louis, Prince Louis, you know, standing beside him, which lifted everyone's spirits in the same way as the five-year-old brought joy to millions of TV viewers on the day of the coronation. The source said that during two full rehearsals on the same day, it took Charles spotting Louis to bring some levity to a tense practice session. He said, it was a long day and everyone was getting a little tired and stressed up. Even the king began to look a little worn out. He was sitting on the throne looking glow. Then suddenly he looked to the side and saw Prince Louis standing beside him. His eyes lit up and said, Hello Louis, I didn't see you yet. You could see how much he adored the little boy. He put an arm around him and began showing him all the regalia. He explained everything to him and pointed out the different gems um, in that snapshot. The two of them seemed completely entranced and it was lovely to watch that. Louis has become known for entertaining royal fans with his animated reactions during royal occasions. During last week's ceremony, he was seen letting out a big yawn while also taking the opportunity to point out something of interest to his elder sister, Princess Charlotte. He yawned again shortly after the king was crowned. The Princess of Wales was also seen bending down to talk to her younger son before he briefly left the two-hour long ceremony, but he returned to sing the national anthem at the end of the service. Louis then seemed entrapped by the crowds along the mall as he travelled to Buckingham Palace by coach and was seen animatedly chatting to his father while on the balcony with his family enjoying the Red Arrows fly pass. Last year, he was seen letting out a howl and clapping his hands over his ears on the Buckingham Palace balcony during the Platinum Jubilee fly pass, as his grand-grand, the late Queen, explained to him what was happening. His older brother, Prince George, took on his biggest role yet on the world stage last week as he carried his grandfather's coronation rough as one of four pages. <laughs>